now we will learn about orienting this section first of all the axis attrib attribute doesn't work on this because it is a straight section the rotate we can rotate this through any angle 90 degree let and I will apply this and it will rotate at 90 degree angle if you see In direction if I want to change then I will give it west axis and give angle apply this and it will rotate in this axis now if it if I give it not sec uh, not then it will move like this like this is the axis and that is the axis of rotation now I can change the direction also with the angle 270 and it will be back here at west I can give 270 and it will be back here at up I will give 270 it will be back to the original shape this is how to rotate a section next thing I can change the beta angle also it changes the orientation like this if one degree minus 180 degree it will be like this see the change like this if I see it cl uh, closely from this side then I can zoom in here beta angle 0 degrees like this the section will rotate beta angle 100 degrees like this if I see beta angle 90 degree will be like this this is rotating this at the upper axis now next is using the flip command I can flip this select and escape this is how to use flip command now one of the very important uh, function in this is connect and disconnect first of all if I have to disconnect these two I will disconnect select this select this and escape these will be disconnected at P node you have to connect any two then will connect select this select this and escape these will be connected here now if I have to trim to P line see it has been disconnected uh, sorry connected now if I have to trim to P line I can pick and escape this will be trim to P line if I need to trim to section then I can pick this one and this one and this one and escape it will be trimmed to section then I can check the utilities also first is data checker it will give the data if I add the CE it will give the details of section 5 and give that data if I select a framework or subframe and add the current element then it will give details of this also no? all the details can be checked through data checker now I can also check construct command and the same way I can control the list or create any copy any circle anything or plane or grids this is construct command I can use the list option also in utilities you have to add the current element now first of all I have to make a list after that I can add and remove any element so I can take any action like this I have to specify the action as per the project so this is how to work on section sections and now I can generate the report also 
it will run the report and it will be saved at your system you can send or mail it anywhere the same report so this is how to work on utilities in 